Hey Taurus, this is your reading and channeled messages for the first half of October 2020. So this is for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. And Taurus, I will get started with your channeled messages first that I received clairaudiently for you while I was tapping into your energy. So Taurus, um, your reading was really positive and I felt that it was just like your spirit guides or your ancestors like speaking to you um, through me. So they said, Taurus, you are diplomatic, caring, and courageous. They said you're doing a good job. You're pleasing your ancestors. And then another message I got for you, Taurus, was that some of you are writing for the paper or writing a paper. And then I heard translating for people the importance of gaining respect for income or financial gain. And this message was like a little unclear. It could have been um, a paper about like the caste system or maybe about like, um, you know, like... Um, I, I don't know, just something like with money or finances and the fairness between different types of people for some reason. So Taurus, if you are resonating with this, I'm sure that you will know what this is about. And I'm sure that it has some uh, collegiate term that I'm just not coming up with right now. So some of you could be writing a paper or writing for the paper, like a newspaper or a blog or something like that. Then I also heard trying out for the field team. So maybe some of you are younger and still in college or something like that. Or it could be that you have um, children and someone or someone in your family is trying out for the field team. That also seemed kind of like symbolic. So um, again, I'm sure Taurus, if you are resonating with this, you will understand that. Or it could be that Taurus that's something in your past. Maybe you were like a track and field star in um, high school or college. So then the final message uh, that I channeled for you, Taurus, was that this is going to be a pleasant time for you um, this month and in these first two weeks of October. So that's great and positive and really high vibe. So I will also go ahead and get you some cards here and we'll just see if Spirit has anything else that they would like to share with you about your first two weeks of October, Taurus. So we have Secrets, Taurus, which is interesting because it came out in the pre-shuffle as well, Secrets, and I did see it and I was like, oh, that sounds juicy, but you know, I wasn't um, in the reading yet, so I just put it back. So it's interesting that it came up again. So here is the card a little closer and it's a number 19 and it says whisper, confidence, or sharing. So let's get some more information about what this energy of secrets is for you, Taurus, in the first two weeks of October. So we have teach that came out in the reverse and that's very interesting because we were just talking a lot about um, school, you know, kind of in a roundabout way. So here you can see the card closer. It is a number five. So I'm going to get more information on this before I say anything actually. Okay, so on teach, we have clarity of belief and lead. So it seems like, Taurus, there is some kind of educational institution that you are in, and perhaps you are a teacher yourself, and um, this has something to do with, like, um, oh, like, you know, the head of uh, education, you know, like a principal or uh, the dean or something like that. So if you're a teacher, maybe there is something that 
um, you know, just like the hierarchy of the school is not believing about some secrets that you have heard, um, possibly about some of the kids, maybe some that are in the track and field or in sports or something. I mean, that really does seem like that could go together. So um, in more general terms, Taurus, even if you're not a teacher, it does seem like you're in some kind of school situation. So at the very least, I see that there is one party that is not being believed about some secrets or gossip or, um, and I think it's between more than just like one or two people, just because of the sharing. It's like, it's like more than one person knows about this and somebody is speaking up and the person that is really in charge, which this is the emperor here, is like just not believing it for some reason. And I do see, it's interesting too how you can see with this teacher card, it's like the kids are there looking at her. So it's like she's the focus, not the kids who may be involved in something that they should not be. Um... So let's see what else we can get about this. So then awaiting results. So maybe this has to do with cheating on a paper or some kind of like final exams or something. Um, yeah, it seems kind of like some sort of nefarious activity. And Taurus, I'm guessing that you are the teacher energy here or the person trying to do the right thing. Um, and if you're not, and the person that's watching this is doing the wrongdoing or whatever the case may be, I guess this could just be a warning. But Taurus, I really believe that you are the energy, this five energy of the teacher here. And so it could have something to do with testing. Maybe somebody like plagiarized a paper um, or there is like a sharing, like, you know, people are sharing homework or sharing papers or like purchasing papers from each other. And maybe these kids for some reason are like sort of being protected in a way, I guess. Let's see if spirit will tell us anything else about um, why it seems that like the uh, upper levels of the education board or whatever it's called for your organization are not believing this thing that's happening. So we have a number one uh, manifest. So this is the magician card. So there is some kind of manipulation going on here, but this is an adult person and there's no um, children involved. So it seems like, I mean, this is a little crazy, but it seems like there is, um, another adult that is, is in on this, like, like maybe the parents somehow have like gotten the kid out of trouble. So, um, Spirit, if you could just give me a final message for the Taurus that is resonating with this story, especially if they are the person who, um, you know, feels that they've done the right thing and tried to make this um, situation known, can you please give me the outcome for them in this situation? So we have Shine and then Love Reversed. So here's a closer look at the love reversed. So, and these people look really young. So, and this person kind of looks also similar to this person, like just a little bit. So what I'm getting from this is that A, the teacher who um, has made this known or like tried to get help about this situation is gonna shine like maybe you don't ultimately get recognized by like this emperor but perhaps by somebody above that and i think too what is going to help is that this love situation is going to break down so maybe you know because this does have to do with like secrets and gossip and um covering up for something or like manipulation or pulling the wool over someone's eyes if there is like a breakup in the group that's responsible or even like somebody's in a relationship that's like in this cheating ring or whatever it is you know if that person 
that person I think is going to like turn on the rest of the crew or maybe they've broken up because somebody got a little freaked out and just like didn't want to get in a bunch of trouble. So that's what I see for the outcome of this situation for you in October, Taurus. That definitely seemed like a very specific message, so I hope that it finds its way to the right person. And if you would please like and subscribe to the channel so you can see more like this. And thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you soon.